everyone uh, welcome back to my channel and today I finally can do a flip through of my 2019 setup in my standard size traveler's notebook and I did this setup in my first ever traveler's notebook that I bought and and I bought it from the one of the largest bookstore in Malaysia Kinokuniya I was uh, trying to figure out what type of planning system that is suitable for me at the time so I thought of trying out Traveler's Notebook and at the time I only know I only know uh, I only knew about this Traveler's company Traveler's Notebook so I bought this one I think it's almost two three years now Yep, so it's been quite a while and you can see it's pretty battered and there's a lot of um, markings and things like that and I love it how it aged and it still smells oh my gosh so good so having said that in this 2019 a totally fresh new year I go back to the first traveler's notebook that I ever owned and I set it up so here, as you can see on the front cover, the Traveller's Notebook itself, I have this uh, Oli clip that I bought during one of their sales. Uh, I think it's around 25% discount. And this is a limited edition one. It's, there's a very gorgeous pink flower. So I got that and I think it's pretty pretty. And let's have a look inside. Okay, first up here on the cover, I'm very sorry about the glaring, so it's almost midnight here and uh, I just got the time to breathe a little. So I just came back from a dinner and uh, meeting with, you know, clients and stuff, so it's a bit tiring, but then I still am very happy and satisfied that I finally able to set up my travel notebook, so I wanted to share this excitement with all of you. So here I have this um, Travis Company's uh, sticker pouch and I have this very very cute bubble mon sticker uh, called die cuts with this bubble mon uh, drinking idea either a coffee or a tea with the scarf over the monster leg <laughs> and here I have this happy scrappy uh, coffee cup or cocoa cup uh, die cuts so I think this is for the fall theme because of the pumpkin but I love coffee cups I do not know why so I still use it here and here this is my first insert so here I have this very very gorgeous vellum paper and it's embossed with this silver foil uh, floral and leaves pattern and I think it's abs absolutely gorgeous so I got this from I think it's I'm not sure about the brand, but I got this from Scrap and Corp, and uh, they I think they have it in gold color and copper color, if I'm not mistaken. So I choose the silver and the gold. It's gorgeous. I love this. So this is a vellum. Oh, sorry about sorry about the glaring. Let me see whether I can fix that. Okay, here we go. So next up is the dashboard. So this is a Chic Sparrow dashboard see there we go Shake Sparrow um, of course that is just the plastic dashboard itself inside the dashboard is of course um, half made by me well actually this is a postcard from Asri Chan a local artist and I love the postcard I think it's absolutely so cute the girl writing on her desk and I love all this very doodly type of drawing with the books here and and the lamb and the pens and of course her teacup and the little cats so I just want to use it as my dashboard and of course it's a little bit shorter the width is perfect so I just stuck a black card behind and I think it works out pretty nice and here I have this quote that says make everyday count now this is actually from a divider 
from my one and only happy planner that I bought during the early times that I started to do planning so I saw the divider they are pretty and the coats are very very meaningful so I don't want to waste it so I cut it out and I think it's gorgeous by just sticking you know two washi on the top and the below and the bottom and it's simple and nice <laughs> to me now this I didn't make any change this uh, sort of like a, a credit card folder so I I still love how it, it looks so far so I didn't make any changes to it I might uh, at some point in time down the road but not now <laughs> so yeah and this is my first journal insert so look, as you can see I still haven't really sort of fill it up yet but I did manage to uh, set it up until the half of 28 yeah okay this is the other part of the credit card dashboard and this is the other part of the dashboard sorry this is not the credit card dashboard this is a credit card folder from Traveler's Company if you've seen my previous flip through I actually have this exactly the same I didn't make any changes to it because I still likes how it turns out and this oh, sorry about the glaring is another uh, happy planner divider so follow your heart and all this arrows and I love it so I just again stuck two strip of washi and voila a simple and nice dashboard ah. okay at the back is of course another postcard by Astri Chan here as you can see introvert favorite stuffs this I love because I think I am quite an introvert I may like to share my thoughts in my YouTube channel but when I'm out with real life people I I sort of do not I do not know how to share <laughs> that much so yeah I consider myself an introvert <laughs> so this is these are the things that I love and like as well I think it's super cute so again I just put it as my dashboard and this is another side of the vellum and this is the same pattern vellum, just that it's in gold color. Okay, here is a first dashboard that I made myself. And I haven't put any, sorry. And I haven't put any picture at the back yet. Because I need some time to find a suitable picture and to print it out. I use the Canon selfie printer but I think I might want to change that. It's quite expensive but I don't know. I don't think it's that convenient. It's a bit big and every time I want to print something I have to like, take it out, um, uh, sort of plug it in and try to connect it and things like that. Uh, I don't know yet. Um, yeah, so this is a dashboard that I made myself. First ever shaker dashboard that I haven't made. And uh, I saw this, the way to do this from this uh, YouTuber called Tantic Creation. I will link her down below. I love all her videos. She is, her videos are very inspirational to me. Even though we don't share the same style of planning. But I just, I don't know, she, in, in a way she still insp inspired me in in uh, creativity of my own. Yeah, I don't know whether you guys understand what I'm trying to say. But this uh, shaker dashboard, I sort of, I got it from her video on how to do it. And I love it using the fuse tool, yeah, which I can show you here. Ta-da! This fuse tool from We Are Memory Keepers. Yep. Uh, it is a bit of a challenge to use these tools like smoothly. Sometimes it does not go smoothly, the, ro the roller thing. But after a few try, you'll get the hang of it. So yeah, I think it's pretty. And I'm going to put something at the back here. Because I'm too excited to share with you guys my setup that, you know, it's okay. I'm just leave, I'll just leave it blank for a while. Or maybe I can put this. Hold on. Does it fit? 
Maybe it will if I cut a little bit here and there, right? Maybe you can try that now. Haha. <laughs> uh, I just saw it, so I think might as well we can give it a try. Right? So just cut it here. Oh, I'm sorry about the. There we go. The lighting, you know, I can only film at night during working days. Yep, here we go. Uh, does it look better? Let's see. See whether I squeeze it in here. Will it go in? Oh, still a bit too big. Still a bit big. Let me cut it a little bit more. top part I have to cut it off a little bit as well I think it's a bit too tall bear with me a while because I just thought about this when I saw this part lying around oh, my table is a mess and I didn't bother to clean it up yet because uh, some of you may know that Chinese New Year is just around the corner and I'm gonna do spring cleaning so I'm gonna clean it up during that my spring cleaning time which is Tomorrow! <laughs> ah! We just go in? Why, why, why? There we go! Perfect! Okay! Ah! <laughs> I'm so happy! It's so pretty! Okay, so this is my shaker dashboard. Ah! Oh, I think it's gorgeous. With this Totoro cute uh it's actually the end of a postcard a total postcard that i bought and i think it's absolutely cute and this is the craft folder from traveler's company that i bought a new one the old one is was very battered and yep i just yeah i, I just have to get get it replaced it's like torn and yeah everything is torn <laughs> So here I also, the first time I bought this uh, Travel's Company sticker for 2019. I just stuck it here just to, you know, pretty it up a little bit. And I also sorted, sort of uh, reorganized my craft folder. I have this 2019, um, what is this called? Writer's Board. I'm sure you guys know what this is. So I got this 2019's uh, the version. Yep. And of course I have some stickers here and some uh, ephemeras. These stickers is from Craftionaries and this one are from London Gifties. Yes. Craftionaries and London Gifties. Two of my favorite sellers. And here I have some vintage tickets and this my paper project uh, sort of this uh, flora and fauna's uh, backers and here I have my monthly insert and these are the stickers from the 2019 uh, version um, 2019 um, sticker sheet <laughs> it's the music team and I love it so this is for my monthly uh, insert and I did a little bit of decals here but not much because I use this for my work my monthly insert is actually my monthly calendar for my bujo oh, what's this? so yeah and I didn't do much deco this year as compared to my previous year monthly insert as you can, you'll see here yeah you can see I did a lot of more deco this 2018 monthly 
Well, the, for the 2019, I tried to keep it simple, minimalist, so I just use this Traveler's Company sticker to go with the theme. Yep. And at the back, I have another coffee cup, uh, die cuts from Happy Scrappy. And I think, again, it's for the autumn theme, pumpkin spice. I have this little owl here. This is, uh, owl is one of my favorite animals. Yep. And here, of course, I have this, uh, Sticker sheet from Traveler's Company, which is uh, in this pack together. And I have some Traveler's Company brochure. And of course some ephemeras and things like that that I can use during my journaling. It's very well organized now. Previously I was, I was like put, just sticking everything <laughs> inside there. And here I have some, uh, this stamp, which is from, where is it? The Traveler's Company. I bought this off a BST uh, from a BST page in Instagram. But it was a very good deal. It's used, but it still very well uh, maintains them. So just, yeah. And this is the back of this uh, dashboard that I made. So this one, I don't know. It's a bit, mm, you can see all the shaker thing. This bling bling or what is this called um glitter confetti i bought this so it's sort of all stuck here because this is the first time i'm doing this shaker dashboard and i didn't manage well on the spacing here so the glitter couldn't go through this way and ended up all the glitter confetti was stuck here and the other side all are empty so I may redo this shaker dashboard but so far I'm still okay with it and I still haven't put anything here and here yet so yeah and this is the other side of the venom so and at the back of course I have another um, this clear sticker pockets which I got from Muji now I think some of you may know Muji does have this type of sticker pockets. Yeah, it's very cheap, four ringgit ninety cent, and you have two pieces inside, one pocket, two sheets. So it's like this. And I just put this uh, again a die cut from Happy Scrappy, a bow clip. Yeah, it's gorgeous. So that is actually my setup for this. New Year 2019 and it took me almost one month because it's now almost the end of January to really completely set this up but actually it's not really complete because I still have these two things here missing but I guess it'll do for now and I think the vellum I may need to adjust it a little bit it's a bit too big here so anyway, I hope you enjoyed the flip through. I hope I didn't babble too much and uh, I'll be doing a flip through for my this ring planner which I use for my finances. From Mystic Little Gift and this is the Crocoline Flamingo. It's gorgeous. This is the pink. It's pink. Smell awesome and I love it. So I'm going to do a flip through of this as well on how I set this up. But for now, this is my setup for my standard size Travelers uh, notebook from Travelers Company. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for um, sitting through 20 minutes of babbling. <laughs> yeah, anything you want to know, please comment down below and I will reply as soon as I can. Thank you guys again. Um, enjoy the, 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 I'm sorry. It's actually 11.30 now, so I want to say enjoy the rest of the night, but I know by the time I upload this video, it won't be night time at all. Anywho, yeah. Um, thank you guys for stopping by. I hope you enjoy this flip through, and i see you guys soon. Bye. Ciao.